If it means this strength must be brought up by the interactions between Pokemon and trainers, then so be it. If it means you have to use a merciless approach like Team Plasmas to force out all the Pokemon's power, then so be it. And yes, if the entire world is destroyed as a result, then so be it. I can't believe you. Time to head into the giant chasm. Find it. Well, let's play Pokemon White 2! Last time, viewers, we met the legendary Pokemon Kyuram, which is under Team Plasma's control. Like, how did Kyuram allow itself to be captured by those fing assholes? It, it, it makes no sense to me. But, you know, that's just how it is. Well, they got away, so we have to enter the um, giant chasm now. We're all the way to the western side of Route 22, by the way. So yeah, this is the part where we couldn't enter before, remember? Yeah, do you remember that side over there? That's where I got the Ice Beam TM when I sequence broke um a, a, a little while back. Before we got to Lokonosha Town. So yeah, if you don't know how to get to it, be sure to watch that episode, because I'm not showing it off. We got shit to do today. So, yeah, the case. You! You're already here, huh? <laughs> well, considering you kind of beat me other places, yeah, I actually beat you for once. Anyone who tries to block us will be running away with their tail between their legs. Yeah, we're going to kick ass and take names. Uh, hey, it's good. We're all set here. It's finally time. Come on, let's go. Right. Huh. You're all alone now, so which one of you or which one of us is going to tackle you? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Which one of us are you going to tackle? Oi, it's me. Me! You know, the X Team Plasma guy? Oh, right, the spy that we saw last time. The one rude X to be a spy. Oh, yeah, I remember you. Being an X Team Plasma is really tough, eh? <laughs> you know, N was so nice to Pokemon, and all I wanted to do was protect Pokemon from bad people. Well, I, I suppose. If we don't crush Team Plasma, then guys like you and that N guy will always be treated like villains. Wow, I am kind of shocked that even came out of Hugh's mouth. Before, he's just a- Oh, all of Team Plasma are bad. They're bad! But... But, viewers, this is character development. Small, steadily, steadily growth th throughout the game. Now he doesn't see everyone from Team Plasma as villains. There are actually good people in the mix. So, like N, for example, he was just confused with, you know, the gets his shit and everything. Okay, I'm out of here, Mike. You, ugh, he's always running off by himself. Thank you, that's so nice. Even if, even if we said it was for Pokemon, in the end, we were doing what we wanted to do. Please excuse me, there's something else I have to do. Right, you go do that. Nice guy, though. He really helped us out there. But in any case, you will definitely meet... Oh, well, thank you for the ghost gem that I'll never use. <laughs> but yeah, you will need um strength and surf to get through here. This dungeon is not really a dungeon at all, but there are a lot of hidden gems around here. If you recall, when I went through here the first time a little while ago, all I came here for was the Ice Beam TM. Now, the walls, uh, there you go. Now, I can actually get the rest of the treasure. I didn't want to get the, all the treasure because I didn't want to spoil um, the items that we get here. In the end, I guess it really doesn't matter because they're poultry at best. The only rare item in this particular cave was the Ice Beam TM. And then, of course, we got this bitch. Why is it always an Excadrill in these dust clouds? I mean, it'd be nice if we had, oh, I don't know, other Pokemon that come out of dust clouds. Like, I don't know, other ground types, for example. We're standing watch here so our allies don't go AWOL. <laughs> NONE SHALL PASS! Sage's orders. <laughs> really, brah? Really? 
none shall pass. I just love the study, the subtle, um, the subtle references they put in the game. I like it. I like it. That's why I love. That's why I love a black, the black and white games. It's just certain things that you wouldn't expect them to do or say in it. They break the mold a little bit. In any case, uh, who the fuck needs strength, viewers, when you can just sequence break shit? Who needs strength? I don't. Well, strength HM, that is. That is. I, I, I meant strength HM. Of course, I need strength. We all do. Especially in, especially in the world we live in today. That being said, though, um, okay, uh, that was everything. Perfect. All right, now let's make our way back to where that um those stairs were. That's how we get out of this place. Oh, as far as the Pokemon are concerned, um, we're in the inner, we're in the outer cave, I think. Where we? Okay, yeah, yeah. There you go. Yeah, because there's different um se side sections here that, that we can go through. Um, we got Palo Swine. Um. Uh, Paloswine, Clefairy, um, oh my gosh, <laughs> my brain is fucking broken today, I am so sorry, viewers, Paloswine, Clefairy, um, Sneeze, I couldn't even pronounce Sneasel's name, oh, fuck that, hashtag Clefefe, this is why I have it in my LPs, viewers, for shit like this, um, Vanellish, Lunatone, Soul Rock, and Delibird. Oh shit! Well, it's a gathering of the of the plasmas. Hmm. In any case, what's going on, Hugh? Come here. Wait a sec. He said he wants to talk to them so his old allies won't get hurt. Oh, it's the root guy. Ah, I will say as many times as it takes until you understand. Getsu's real plan was to take over the Unova region. Liberating Pokemon was nothing more than an excuse. If anything, it would have made Pokemon suffer. Uh, huh. Yeah, that's a pretty speech, Gramps. Fool! We're not going to listen to what a traitor has to say. Wow. Well, that didn't work. Hey! <laughs> Nice! I like I like the exclamation points, dear. They overdid it, though. Let me through, or you will feel my rage. What are you saying? Looking to get hurt, dude? I'm going to get the stolen Pokemon back. I'm not going to listen to villains like you. Rude, XT Plasma. Why do you have Pokemon by your sides? Uh, to protect what's important to you, right? Even if your precious Pokemon gets hurt, even if your ideals are damaged, the time to fight is now! You're just a kid! Quit trying to act so fucking cool! Whatever. Nobody's getting close to the Plasma Frigate. Wipe them all out! <laughs> no escape! Not one! Mike, as usual, take the other one. You got it, pal. Like he said, we're going to crush you along with the traitors. You are nothing but shit! You grunts are shit! And you think you're gonna defeat someone with eight badges? Come on. Because Team Plasma exists to cause trouble. Your trouble is about to be doubled. Now! This time! Well, it's not a boss fight. Plasma! But yeah, we're just fighting Plasma grunts. Nothing special. <laughs> Although, I will always always say that the male plasma grunts hand through animation the oh, is just amazing. Amazing! They, it's just the attention to detail. It's amazing. I don't get on! There you go. Ah, broke today. Did I sound like a military general there, viewers? Eh? What do you mean, no? Huh, whatever. I think I sound good. <laughs> and to me, that's all that matters. Okay, good job, buddy. Glide. Ah, yeah. Ew, we're facing the shit blob again. Glide, get it out of here, dude. Earthquake that bitch. Ugh, just looking at Muck makes me want to throw up. Look at it. Look how ugly it is. 
Oh, terrible. Plasma! Are you two done? Cool. Are your Pokemon okay? You should take these with you. Oh! Thank you! Those will be needed later. Whew. You too. Thanks. I'm passing through. Oh, it looks like their backup arrived. Oh, shit! It's only two grunts. At times like these, those whose hearts weaken, those whose determination falters, can accomplish nothing. To save our old allies, to protect Unova, we will fight. Both of you, go. No, just a moment. You, was it? About the Pokemon you're looking for. In all likelihood, it is in the possession of the Shadow Triad, the dark warriors who appear silently. The Shadow Triad has it? Got it. If I rescue it, that, that helps you guys absolve your guilt, doesn't it? Guess I'll help you out. You. At that time, I believed we were on the side of justice. By serving my king in, I was going to make, the, make a world without war. But I was conceited, and I couldn't see the unhappiness we were causing. That's why I can't let it happen again. I understand. We will stop Zimzalon and whatever he, whatever the fuck he's trying to do. In any case, we get the Razor Claw here. I, if memory serves, I think that helps either... No. I think the Razor Fang was needed to help um, Gliger evolve into Gliscor. The Razor Claw is needed to help evolve Sneasel into Weavile. They both need to be holding those Razor items at specific times of the day in order for them to evolve into their respective forms. If memory serves, that is. That being said though, we got a little bit of a winter wonderland up in this bitch. Can you guess who did it? <laughs> no, take a wild guess. Whoa! Oh. Oh yeah, well we got literal ice. Nice. I like that. We got a literal ice puzzle to go through. Not really an ice puzzle, but we just going through it. <laughs> Anything's better than the fucking ice path puzzle. <laughs> Shit. In any case, back on the frigate again. How's it going? Going ahead. I'm going to make them tell me about the Shadow Triad. If you find Perleon or the Shadow Triad, let me know. <laughs> but yeah, oh yeah, that's right. The guard was blocking this part here. Uh-oh. Hey, dude. Nay, I do, uh, I do, wait, what? I do ambush thee. Uh-oh, shit. <laughs> You've been ambushed! Look who got ambushed instead. <laughs> Plasma! Damn. Lose. Just go and lose already. A kid like you should definitely lose. Who the fuck is salty? Wow. If that if that be the case, then farewell. Forgive me. What the fuck is with these grunts? Whatever. <laughs> it's, it's like it, it's like the guy on the left was speaking in, in cyan language. Does Mr. Down like shiny thing? At last, we meet again. Remember me, formerly of Team Plasma? I've been waiting for you. Oh, it's you again. Spying is such a rotten job. I contacted Root of the Seven Sages, but nobody showed up to help me. That's because they're out there fighting. <laughs> I can't stand it. Everybody around me is always saying bad stuff about Lord N. But Lord N learned the error of his ways and changed course for a better path. Yeah, they call him a betrayer. People really stink sometimes. Yeah, stinky! They stink! They selfishly count, counted on him, and now they selfishly make a big fuss about being betrayed. Oh, I nearly forgot to tell you. This floor is a maze of pipes. You gotta step on switches to connect or disconnect the pipes. It's a good thing you can walk on the pipes. Cool, good to know. Unfortunately, we got plasma grunts in this bitch. Let's see. Oh, you see. Alright, yeah. He was right, though. This place is a literal maze of pipes. 
And we got plasma grunts all over this place. I'm gonna take them all out, viewers, if you don't mind. You got shit to do today. The Fighting Furies. We are the Team Plasma! Alright, viewers of Mac. Now, in order to proceed to break through that barrier at the top there where the green portal was that we warped into from this room, now, you have to step on those four switches. The one that you just saw at the beginning that I just showed you just now. Yeah, these ones right here. There are four switches. Two on the left side, two on the right side. You have to step on all four of them in order to deactivate the barrier that's blocking the center there. So basically, you have to navigate yourself around these um, these warp panels and shit, taking down the grunts as you go along. So yeah, just you just step on these red switches to connect and disconnect the bridges and stuff to get to them. Now, switch number one is the second column from the left that's near a plasma grunt. Switch number two is in the northwest corner of the maze. Switch number three is the third column from the left near a female plasma grunt. And switch number four is northeast corner of the maze. So use that to your advantage. I would show I would um, tell you guys or I would I would have showed you guys, you know, all about that, but it would have taken way too damn long and we don't got time for that. We got shit to do, so you guys can figure it out. My viewers are smart, so you can do it. You being my viewers, that is. You're smart. The device is indestructible. You will never be able to release Kyu Ram. <laughs> Where are you, Zim Salon? Uh oh. You don't have the sense to know when to quit, it seems. Why would I quit knowing I can easily beat your ass? It's an act of mercy on my part to bring this to an end now. <laughs> Our last bro down? Fine. Bring it on, old man! It's time for a boss fight! Versus Simsalon! Now, our final battle with Simsalon. Is he stronger? No, not really. Now we got Weavile. Yeah, exert that pressure, baby. It's, it's still not going to be enough, unfortunately. Not for you. Your ice shark won't do shit to me! <laughs> Still wake <anger>! You! <laughs> so you're about to lose again! Are you done? No, apparently not. Let me show you to the door. <laughs> Bitch! Don't matter, don't matter. See? You, you spam all that shit and it still means nothing. Night Slash! And you lose to a move that Weavile's not even weak against. Goodbye! Zimsalon, that's good game. Wow. You're not a threat to anyone. You never were. Beaten again? No matter. Team Plasma will get the last laugh. Just give the fuck up. You're trash, and you know it. Seriously, anyone that uses three ice types on their team is just, it's just an idiot. Seriously. I mean, I, I, I don't mean to offend anyone that likes using three ice types on their team and shit, but come on. The dude that two pure ice types, and Weavile is good, but it's slash dark typing don't mean shit. It don't mean shit. It just means it's even more weak to more fighting, to like fighting types and shit. It means absolutely nothing. Mm. And in any case, there's a warp tile to the left that's blocked, so we have to take the one to the right. Don't worry, Kayu Ram, I'll get you out of there. Ugh. One thing, we gotta find a way to deactivate the damn thing. Oh. NANI?! Desires to bring out the entirety of Pokemon potential. If I can't, if I can accomplish that, I don't care what it takes. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? So you'd sink as low as the jointing plasma for this? 
If it means this strength must be brought up by the interactions between Pokemon and trainers, then so be it. If it means you have to use a merciless approach like Team Plasmas to force out all the Pokemon's power, then so be it. And yes, if the entire world is destroyed as a result, then so be it. I can't believe you. I can't believe you. All this shit. I thought, I thought you were such a cool dude, a cool scientist, and everything like that. I thought your intentions were pure. But then you go and join this shitty group. For what? That aside, the reason I've been traveling all over Unova and battling many Pokemon trainers is because I was testing the viability of this approach to bring out the full strength of Pokemon. In that respect, you've done an amazing job. Well now, tell me if you have the answer I desire or not. If you're ready, come at me. You can't be serious. Our viewers of Mac just need to compose myself after that shit. Chloris, I can't believe you, dude. But if you stoop this low, then you're no better than the Team Plasma Grunt. I'll take you down just as easily. It looks like you're ready then. Okay, let us begin. Yeah, let us begin this. And end this. Our acquaintanceship is over. Because it's time for a boss fight! Versus Chloris! And viewers, we finally get to hear his battle theme. It's about damn time! Yes! I'll shut up for a minute so you can hear his theme. Amazing, isn't it? Amazing! And viewers, it gets better. Watch. Bruh. <laughs> it was getting to the crescendo! Oh, that's bull! Switching out. Damn it. <sighs> Whatever. You see, it was getting to the crescendo and the fucking music there had to fucking ruin it. Hurry up. Whatever. <laughs> Alright. Ah! Let Fuck this sturdy ability! Fuck that it's so good. I thought this battle was gonna be a piece of cake, but once again he proves me wrong. And oh! Volt switch! I'm impressed, Chloris. These tactics. Magnezone! Land driver! Not that it matters, because this fucking Magnezone has it too! Damn! His Pokemon are tough. It's like I'm fighting a, a boss trainer from Sinnoh. This is crazy! Why would you use Flash Cannon on a fire type? Okay, that was the real dumb part right there, buddy. Dumb. The Vanger! There you go. Get this bitch out of here. Magnezone is a cool looking Pokemon, though, I must say. Must say. In any case, Metang. Steel slash psychic type. You guys know what he evolves into, right? It should go without saying. Ooh! Unfortunately, being part steel means he will also get his ass kicked by fire moves. So, no matter how much of a pseudo legendary you want to be, you still have your weaknesses. Such a shame, really. Oh, his clank evolved! It has a it has an air balloon too. I think that means it's immune to ground attacks. Of course, once it gets hit by a move, it won't matter. So, you know. Land driver! <laughs> if only your Clink Link had, had sturdy. Damn. Well, alright, Bleem is next. Alright, let's switch out. Good job, Art. You're strong, Chloris. I'll give you that much. Maybe that's the reason Team Plasma actually needed your, your power. 
such a shame, man. You sunk too low. Nice slash! If only you could have used your scientific powers for good. But if you're willing to fucking risk the entire world based on a based on theories and ideology and shit, then you're no different than them. Such a shame. Though your battle theme kicks massive ass. I love it. Just a shame it has to end so soon! But that's the way the cookie crumbles! Hurry up! Finally! Yeah, spamming the fuck out of recover. That shit. Alright, his magneton is already weakened already, so this won't even be a thing. Good job, Fury. Let's go, baby! Let's end this, Loris. I'm more psyched than I've ever been. I can still go on. Correction! You can't! And fight off! Can you still go on? No. It's over. Good game. Nice try, but good game. So this is what means to throw forth the power hitting your Pokemon. That it is! So strong. You're a very strong trainer indeed, so let me ask you this. Are you thinking of reaching even higher heights by understanding each other and as Pokemon and trainer? Of course I am! Why would I be on this journey otherwise? I see. To me, that is the ideal answer. To think, that's what you actually believe. You bring out the power of your Pokemon with respect and love. Excuse me for repeating myself, but if it will make Pokemon stronger, I don't care what it takes. If interacting with Pokemon can increase their powers only to a certain point, then their full strength must be brought out using a scientific method approach. Even one without a conscience. But you have shown me the, approach, the potential of your approach. To me, whether Team Plasma wins or whether you win will decide how the relationship between people and Pokemon should be. So... Where will this, where will this be settled? Step on the warp panel on the other side of the room where Kyuram is being held. Good luck in your battle. Thanks. Chloris, I'm glad that you are starting to see that we have potential too. You don't have to always use force and brutal and brutality to bring out your Pokemon. No, that's not how it is. Well, viewers, we took him down Chloris and now all that's left to do is the free Kyuram. But how easy or hard will it be? And what about you? Find out next time. If you guys enjoy, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for gaming bits for me. And of course, when you subscribe, be sure to hit the bell so notify of my new uploads. Got something to say? Of course you do. Leave a comment, duh. So next time, dudes and dudes, this is Mike from Rage Break Gaming, and I hope your rage breaks. Have a great day, my bitches and bros. Smile you later.